Okay, this is just a very quick little video to show you how you can clone a GitHub repo from the command line. So I'm in my terminal right here. I have Git installed. I installed GitHub Desktop, which gave me Git. You can install Git separately. You can install GitHub Desktop to get those. So I'll just a simple search for Git download will bring you to the Git website. You can download that for Linux, Mac, Windows, whatever you want, or GitHub Desktop. There it is. Here's the website for GitHub Desktop, and you can download that for the appropriate Windows, Mac, Linux, whatever you need. Now, what I want to do is once I've, now that I have this installed, what I want to do is I want to clone my repo on my computer without having to open up GitHub Desktop, because sometimes you don't want to just open a program to do one simple thing. So cloning is a very simple task. I'm just copying the files that are on the server on my computer and then setting up a folder to be a GitHub repository on my own computer. Now we can come to GitHub and click on the clone or download button. You can open in desktop, so it'll use GitHub desktop to download it. You can download the zip file, but why not use the actual git command on the command line? So I'm going to copy this URL right here, or we can click on this button to copy to the clipboard. Same thing. Then in terminal, I'm just going to say git clone, and then the name of the repo that I'm going to clone. So git clone the URL and then optionally by default it'll create a folder called whatever the repo is but you can add a name if you want. So I'm going to call it mm, media. Enter. This is going to create that folder M media, download the repository, stick it inside there and say that it is a GitHub repository. So if I go to my finder Here's the folder I was in. Here's mmedia that has been created. And you can see right here, .git. There is the .git folder with all the Git information. So this is a GitHub repo or a Git repo on my computer. And I can continue to use it from that point on. All right, so I hope that helps you out. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. And as always, thanks for watching.